All right, guys, I am back. It is Thursday, April 20th, 2023. This means a lot to uh, people who smoke a lot of weed. Not that I haven't, but just don't care today about any of that. Just been really not fun. Um, my birth mother, who was around for the past many weeks, left yesterday. And I know she had to go home, but... You know, I think about it sometimes and I realize, like, all the time I really had with her, almost one-on-one, -on -one, was 2011 until 2017 when some tricky hands behind the scene um, worked it so that I didn't really see her after that. And it kind of sucks because it's just such a short period of time. I mean, I'm only 46, so what is that, like six six whole years of my life. So I got to have her within a reasonable distance and that's never gonna happen again because I don't see us moving back to Colorado anytime soon because it's expensive and we can't afford it. We can't even afford here, honestly. And it's beautiful outside, it's sunny, all the trees are full of leaves, you know, it can be pretty in Alexandria, Virginia, I'm right outside DC, but it's just not. Um, I just don't know. I don't have any good opinions of it, but again, it's like me and my husband and my dog, and that's it. And most of the time my husband has to work during the weekdays. He comes home and he needs his downtime and I'm alone all day. And at this point, I'm not really sure I can work at all. I mean, I, I just don't know. I really don't. Um, I don't think that my memory is great. I don't feel good. I'm in a pain a lot. Again, I just, I felt like crap for years and I, and I don't know if there's any way to really think yourself out of it really, you know, I try. You know, I, you guys probably have noticed I really try to be super positive about this because it has affected so much of my life, so much of my future, so much of my current, so much of, uh, obviously the past doesn't really matter, but right now I'm just trying to figure out how we're going to be okay, how I'm going to figure out some way to contribute, um, just find some way to be happy because I, I don't like it here. I have no support. I don't have anyone to call when things go bad or good for that matter. I don't have anyone to celebrate with. You know, I don't have anyone. I just don't have anyone. And I can't imagine continuing on like this for another however many years. We've been here since September 2020 and we've made, we had a few friends at once and I think they got just so overwhelmed with my health problems and then Don broke his leg and you know young people don't need to deal with that crap nobody does honestly that's usually safe for people you've already you know established a long-term friendship a relationship with and they just kind of end up helping you because you've already got the foundation of friendship to kind of sustain you through the difficulties and at this point I just don't even know what to say or do you know, I'm just trying to figure out ways I can hide my medical problems and my scars so that I don't have to answer those questions and I can just pretend I'm just a random person like everyone else, just randomly trying to survive in a crappy town in Virginia where people are not nice, exactly. They're not mean, exactly. They're just indifferent because they have different goals than I do. I'm just trying to survive. That's it. That's all my husband's trying to do. You know, he'd like to buy a house, but I think I have to die for that to happen, honestly. That's the only way he's going to get a deposit. There's just no way I'm going to ever do it. Anyway, depressing, right? I didn't really mean to be depressing. I'm just not happy. And I'm lonely again, and I'm going to be lonely for the foreseeable future. And that just sucks. But anyway, this is my video for... April 20th, 2023, and I hope you guys are awesome. All right, take care. Bye.